We will discuss a study that compared different strategies for maintaining weight loss after an initial low-calorie diet. In this study, 195 adults with obesity followed an 8-week low-calorie diet, losing an average of 13 kilograms. Afterward, they were divided into four groups for one year, an exercise group, a liraglutide group, a combined exercise plus liraglutide group, and a placebo group. The goal was to see which method worked best for keeping the weight off. When we look at the results, the exercise group lost 4.1 kg more than the placebo group over the year, and their body fat decreased by 1.7%. While exercise alone didn't lead to the most dramatic weight loss, it had important benefits for overall fitness and muscle mass, making it a valuable approach for long-term health. The liraglutide group, who took the medication daily, did better in terms of pure weight loss, losing about 6.8 kg more than placebo. They also saw a 1.9% reduction in body fat. However, liraglutide came with some side effects, including nausea and increased heart rate, which weren't as common in the exercise group. Now, when we look at the combined group, those who did both exercise and took liraglutide, they had the best results. This group lost 9.5 kilograms more than the placebo group and had the largest reduction in body fat with a 3.9% drop. While this combined approach clearly led to the most weight loss, it's important to note that it didn't dramatically outperform liraglutide alone in every way, though it did help limit some of the side effects like heart rate increases that were seen with liraglutide on its own. In summary, liraglutide was more effective for weight loss than exercise, but exercise brought unique benefits for fitness and muscle. The combination of both was the most powerful strategy for weight loss and fat reduction, offering the best of both worlds, though it also comes with the highest level of effort. If you need help with weight loss, our obesity clinic offers personalized support. You can reach us anytime. Contact details are in the description.